Okay, I said I wasn't going to do another video for quite a while now, so, but I decided I'll do one anyway. I was bored and there's nothing to do, so I'll do one on this dirt bike. Kawasaki two-stroke 100. It's not bad. Two-stroke, oil injected. There's probably the gas in there. I don't know. There's not much to say about it. I think it's got a five speed. I don't know. Um, it's like it. It could be. It was like a street bike because it had all the turn signals and whatever. But took them off because we're just riding around the farm here, and the brake light works and stuff. It has a little horn, whatever. There's the turn signals, um, lights, so you could ride. I don't know if it works, I don't think it does. Engine off, engine on, whatever. Here's the key, high beam, just the little lights, says if it's in neutral. I don't know, I don't think any of these lights work. We just overhauled it, I don't know. I don't know, it was quite a few years ago, I think two maybe, wasn't running this year, put a new spark plug in there, I was riding around here, it's a really nice dirt bike, I mean, there's not too much to complain about it, I mean, it's a, it's a, the normal two-stroke problems, like, backfiring sometimes, oh, I never gave you the year on it, it's 19, like, 70s, 77, I think. It's a really nice dirt bag. Right by the clutch is the, your choke. Right there, that little thing, you pull it up, and then your choke. There's the fuel shut off, so you don't flood it. Kickstart. Well, I guess I'll, there's nothing really else to say about it. I guess I'll give you the tire size, maybe. Oh, um, 2.5, 2.75 by 19. Same for the back, probably. You can adjust the shocks, it looks like. I guess I'll just start it up. Maybe I'll start one kick, maybe. I don't know. I'll try it out. Okay. One kick, maybe. Five thousand miles on it. Somebody drove this a lot. Somebody drove this a lot before us. I don't know. Dad got it at a auction sale for. Was it two hundred or three hundred dollars? Put a new piston and overhauled it. Took a little bit of time, but I don't know if it was worth it. I think it was worth it. I don't know. Pretty fun to ride around. I have my helmet in there. It's right there. It's blue, and that's red. It doesn't really work. But whatever. I guess I'll turn off the fuel here. And it goes off. I guess that's really it. There's our plow over there. I'll go. Go over there. Maybe. Just go over there and show it around. Three bottom John Deere. Packer wheels. Little driller. It's a whole deal. Just got it out today. Here's the spring hitch. There's the arm going back to the drill. There's two of them, just broke one off. Three bottom. Yeah, it's pretty nice. There's where you put the grain in. Whatever. Put it in, drill it in the ground. There's the skid steer we really want to get rid of. 
anyone want it, hit us up, we'll sell it. There's its bucket. The reason we don't like it is because, I'll show you. It's right here, you see this, this little door here? This little door, open it up. And when you put this up a little bit, you put it up, put the arms up, you put the arms up, and it has that little door to open up, you know? And you, when you open up the door, you see if you lift this up, it would break off the door. So, and you, you lift it up right by the door, and say the, it's right there, it wouldn't be able to open up. And so when my, my dad's filling chemical, and he lifts up a shuttle, and, it, and, it's, and it's right there, right there in front, of the, in front of the cab door, he can't even get out because it's just blocking the door. He can't even open the door. So we want to just try to sell this one and get like a skid steer with like no arm on the right side. And yeah, it'd be way nicer because like the door... Is on the right side, and you can just get out like that. I like pressing this whole siren thing. It's pretty cool. Yeah. But, yeah. There's a straight piped Ford. Um, the gator, I'll just show you around there, too. It's just 855D diesel. I think the D stands for diesel, I don't know. We put these lights on there because uh, the stock ones are pretty crappy. I mean, in the light kit, uh, it's it's way too expensive, so we just put on regular ones. Uh, fully, full cab, I don't think you can take it off. You can take off the door, so we did that. Little screen. You can, it just shows you your miles per hour and whatever there's a four wheel drive 791 hours yeah it's whatever it has a little heater it would really kick in the winter you, you just turn that whole thing on there's your little heater for in the winter it really heats this up it's really nice there's its little storage cover you just keep the seeds in there there's full power tilt not for its box. For its box and whatever. Yeah. It's really nice. I like this gator. But there's windshield wiper. There's our light switch. Turn on lights. There's our four by to kick in and kick out. Um, the lights, just like the regular stock ones, crappy. Brake and pedal. It's really nice. I like it. It's not too bad. It seems like it's pretty rugged. I mean, yeah. We we've been pretty hard on it. I like that. It's a little. You can put your hitch right there, and you can pull it. Yeah. This Kubota. This thing has. Low, 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 low hours on it. 94 hours on the oil filter. Up here, like uh, on now hours, has 296 hours. And that's exact. 296 hours. It's, yeah, it's 60 inch deck. It's a nice tractor. It's not bad. I mean, it rolls coal. It really, it really needs, because it's 91 hours on oil change, last oil change, and has 296 hours. So that's like, I don't know, 100 something hours on it. So we should really change the oil. Here's its rolling coal. You can lock the front differential and the back one. You can have a, 
It has front wheel assist. I mean, that's really crazy for a little little garden tractor, but here's the speeds, low and then high. You put it in low for mowing, then you put it in high for just driving around. So, yeah. Here's the deck lift down, right? Here's the front front lock, four wheel drive. That's off. Here's the throttle, up, down. You can put on your lights, turn them off, turn signals. There's your hazard lights. I don't know why it even has them. I mean, you're, you're not gonna like, drive down the road with this thing. Yeah, I guess this is just a little update. Just kinda got sidetracked off of that thing. Let me know if you want more of these kind of videos. I don't know. I don't know. Probably gonna get copyrighted on this music. Whatever. Don't like this channel. Nobody likes it anyway. Here's 322. It still runs like a champ. Here we go. Dang it. Runs like it always has. I guess. Yep. I think we're all done here. That's it. Uh, and, um, uh, out by my grandpa's place, there's, there's big cottonwood trees. I don't know. They're just, they're huge. And, um, our, our old, uh, 90, uh, 9280, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong. Um, 9280 quad track. It was out there on our drill, big drill, and it was just out there. And a big cottonwood fell on it, cracked our globe, our expensive globe, broke that all, bent down the cab, I don't know, two inches, popped out the glass, didn't break it, hopefully. Well, I know it didn't. It didn't break. It just popped out of its socket. So, called our insurance. They didn't, they're helping out. But that's really bad. It's, oh, big, big hole. Big hole in the 9280 quad track. Yeah. That's pretty bad. So, let me know if you want more of these long <coughs> videos. Let me know if you want short videos. Let me know what you even want to see. There's the new quad track back there. If you can see the cab, it's right behind there. It's right there. Behind the stack of the treasure. Uh, bulls per turned on the fence. Let me know if you want short videos. Or let me know if you want long videos. Let me know if you want regular videos. Just tell me what you want. I'll show it. Whatever. Any tractors you want to know about. I can maybe show them. Any want tractors you want to know in detail about? I'll just maybe do a little review on them. Just tell me, I'll do, try to do it. Yep. I guess. Yep. Bye.